Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Sorry I've only been posting once a fortnight, it's just because life's been getting a little bit hectic at the moment. Um, I have been working full time and I'm thinking of starting a podcast soon. Um, I'll give you guys some more information when I have the information to give you basically. Um, I haven't actually filmed or recorded any podcasts yet. Um, but I'm going to be recording th over the next month and I'll tell you guys a little bit more information in the future. If you haven't subscribed to my vlogging channel, go subscribe because I do post there every week. Um, it's a lot easier for me to make vlogs since I don't have to sit down and create a video. I just um, document my days. So if you haven't subscribed, it's called Brittany Vlogs. Um, and I've also put the links around my main channel as well. So it would be on the top right hand corner on the channel banner. So go subscribe there if you want to see more of me. <laughs> if you don't already see enough of me throughout the month. So I was at a meeting on Monday and we were talking about a topic revolving getting stuck in a rut and not excelling forward and I felt like I was in this rut for a really long time in my life this rut was kind of the last year I felt like I was doing things that weren't getting to me me to where I wanted to go and it was really frustrating and I was really struggling and it was kind of like I was stuck in this circle going around and around and around and everything I did let me back to the start again and I know looking back now what was wrong with what I was doing but I just couldn't figure it out at the time and it was making me very emotional and it was like I was building up these emotions and then I would break and then I'll do something like I'd book a trip somewhere or um, a weekend away and I'll try to escape for a bit and then I'll come back with a either no money or B I'd come back trying to start from scratch again I'd always come up with new ideas I would always, I shifted jobs a lot and it's like I just couldn't get out of the circle. So something I haven't actually told you guys on camera was I went to therapy a few weeks ago, uh, about a month ago now, and I was releasing things that I didn't even know that I needed to release. And I don't know if it was the fact that I was releasing things that made me move forward, but it really felt like figuring out what I was having issues with really allowed me to push that aside, get that off my back, or and focus on what I need to focus on. Now, I don't really feel like I did anything in terms of um, career-wise, or I don't think I feel, did anything in terms of social life that really was completely different to what I did. So one thing I really felt that helped was that I was releasing things that probably was kind of keeping me back, if that makes sense. Um, so I was going around and around in circles and I finally, something happened in my life where I knew that I had to go to therapy. It was a big thing, it was quite emotional and I was like, okay, this is the point where I think I need a little bit more help. So I went to therapy, I started releasing things and the week I started going there, things kept popping up in my life that things hadn't popped up before. And this was surprising me, like I was seeing things in a different way, I was doing things a little bit differently and I kind of felt like this frustration was slowly disappearing and I felt like I was achieving things at quite a rapid pace. Now this might sound odd but I felt like it just kind of expanded, I don't know how to say this. I don't know if many people have been through this feeling before but it was really just identifying the issues but not trying to identify them myself. When I was trying to un identify them myself I wasn't seeing beyond what I needed to see. I just felt like it was a time in my life that I kind of got so caught up and it was so getting so frustrated and everything was building up and building up and building up and building up and then finally it was a little bit of like a release. It actually wasn't a little bit of release, it was like a huge release, let's be honest. It was this huge release and then I took the next step. I did a lot of self-help stuff, self-care, self-love. And because I started releasing things, new opportunities came my way. Now there's that saying that when doors close, new doors open. And I feel like that was exactly what I was doing. I was closing old doors that needed to be closed a while ago and doors were just opening up here, there and everywhere. So yeah, 
I don't know what the point I was trying to make with that. I just kind of wanted to put a little um, story out to the world. I wonder if anyone else is feeling like they're in that situation. And what happened to them to kind of shift that, that balance in their life. Um, but I'm hoping that I'll be making videos once a fortnight. I can't promise that I'll start making them once a week yet until I start getting my life sorted out a little bit better. I'm trying to balance everything and um, one of the main reasons I'm starting a new podcast is because I want to learn from people who have been able to balance their life a lot better. So yeah, I think I'll end this note on saying happy Monday. I hope you have a lovely afternoon. Grab a cup of tea, jump into a really nice book. Tonight I will be sitting down reading um, what is it called? Rich Dad, Poor Dad. Thanks for listening and thanks for watching my video today. Don't forget to subscribe to my ch channel if you haven't already done so. Uh, I'll see you guys hopefully in a fortnight. Bye!